Hello everybody, welcome back to EU4, King of Jerusalem Achievement. We just lost near uh, Venice in the last run, because they got involved in a big fight, as they sometimes does, or do. It's either, they don't have a chance. Aragon was in that war as well, so. There we go. We might be able to uh, get them back as allies later on, if they survive this. But uh, other than that, <coughs> we're just waiting for the uh, Ottomans to attack um, the Mamluks and just gain as many admin points as possible. See, we are making point th zero point three. Yeah, we can't afford an advisor either. So, oh, there we go. Yeah, that's what usually happens. Venice gives up. They're still in the other war though. And then they simply um, give up Crete and probably Naxos as well. No, they're still in there. But uh, Crete is up for grabs. Um, I might want to take it. It's a five base tax province, but um, it's also Greek and Orthodox. So uh, it might be worth. Uh, it might be more trouble than worth. Because I don't have the ability to um, send a missionary there. And I'll probably end up if I if I succeed in it. I would maybe get one extra regiment out of it. So in uh, in that respect, it's not really worth it, or in that perspective, I should say. And they got peace there. So the first piece, oh, that was not the one. Venice be forced to give Milan ten percent. Venice will cede Brescia to Milan. Venice will pay 30 ducats. Okay, so they just lost Brescia in that war, and they lost Verona to Austria in the other war. Plus, uh, they have released Croatia. Corfu is still a vassal. And Naxos and Crete has been released. I wonder if we can be friends with them. I think we can. Well, at least Naxos. Let's go ahead and build some relation with these guys. Offer alliance. I don't know how much they can help, but um, let's try. These guys are still hostile and these guys are riddled. So not much we can do about that. I bet the Ottomans got... Uh, no, Ottomans don't got any claims on that. Unhappiness. Uh, well, stability is just too damn expensive, so I'm gonna lose the five ducats here. And we need 400 to take the next uh, idea. We can get the uh, military tech 5, that's fine. It'll give us some new units. Uh, I think we should be pretty safe to uh, change them. What do we want here? We want um, men at arms, defensive shock. Let's do that. We got 54 relations with uh, Venice, but now they're so far away that we got the uh, we got the malice. Yeah. 
No, we don't. Minus 20 for neutral attitude and minus 9 for trust. They don't trust us anymore. But we fully, uh, fully improved the relations. And it's going to take some time for the, uh, the two malices to go away. But we'll monitor it. They'll still be useful as allies. If only these guys could lose their attitudes. So what kind of rebels are in here? Uh, Orthodox zealots. Right, so when will the, the Ottomans attack? Well, it could be any time now, actually. It suits me fine that it will take a little while because I need three more ideas to get to this one, very important. And we can get the first one now, which is missionary schools, plus one missionary. Let's grab it. So we now have two missionaries, but no missionary strength. That's the problem. If the Ottomans attack the Malnox right now, uh, we might have to pass because we are we're simply not ready to um, to convert these guys down here. Plus, it would be nice to get Venice back as an ally. Only minus sixteen now. That could be possible still. Obviously, obviously, there's also the chance that these guys will stop being hostile towards me. What about Cyprus here? They're also hostile. Renaissance Prince. Uh, gain prestige and lose some money. Yeah, I think we're going to go with that. Still got 10 ducats. If I ever get to 20 ducats, I will probably build a bark and see where I can get some trade in. But it's going to take like forever. 30 months to get 10 ducats. That will help the economy a little bit. Oh, let's go back to Venice here. Uh, they've been nerfed quite a lot now. They only have four provinces and one vassal. Gain stability? Yes, please. So the two stability I lost before, I have regained again. See, we got the distance between borders here, but we don't get that with Venice. Oh, that's because of Corfu, maybe. Coffer is slightly uh, closer. <clears throat> bam 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 bam. What about these guys? Still rival me? Still hostile here. Are we back to 82 here? <clears throat> and they're not angry with us. They're just disappointed. They're like parents. They're not angry. They're just di disappointed with our behavior before. But I'm pretty sure we would have been uh, knocked out by like Aragon or something if we entered that war. <clears throat> so it was better to just pass it. And there might be a chance to get them back. Minus 15 at the moment. Well, basically anything can happen here, so... We can be back, we can be destroyed in two months if the Ottomans wants to do that. That's kind of... Uh, that's the odds in this uh, campaign here. 
minus 13. Yeah, so we are basically waiting for Ottomans to attack Mamluks, and meanwhile we will get as many ideas as we can. Uh, I'd like the prestige here. Still minus 22 prestige. So... Making slightly more money now. <clears throat> we got 300 admin points again, so soon we can get the next idea, which will be what's it called? Church attendance duty, stability cost minus 25%. And then after that, we will get the Divine Supremacy. That's the one we really want. Oh, the Ottomans have uh, attacked Byzantium. Who are allied with Creed. Okay, pretty happy that I didn't uh, become allies with them. Oh, they got the obligatory claim in there. <clears throat> so the big question is, are we next or will they go for the Mamluks? Hopefully Mamluks. And we will get the next idea pretty soon here. Next month. Yep. Church attendance duty. Which will also give us 25% for defense. One more idea to go. Looks like they took uh, Chios and left Crete alone. No, they're still, uh... It looks like it's still being sieged down. That may be just me. Oh, they didn't take Creed at all. Maybe because they, oh, they... They even have a claim there. That was strange. What about Venice? Monetary reforms, lose stability, gain inflation. Uh, I think I'll just lose the inflation actually. Oh, we don't have any inflation. So lose stability, I'll gain three inflation. Mm, I think I'll go for the inflation. How much does that cost us? We actually gained money from that. <laughs> that was a bit strange. Anyway, the Venice. How far are we from allying them again? Ten negative reasons. Okay. Yeah, so we need to get the fourth uh, religious idea and some spare admin points, about 200 maybe. We can take this one. We can build embassy, yeah. We don't have the money to build embassy. We can build a ship though. Do we want to do that? Yeah, might as well. Got nothing else to spend my money on. Let's build a bark. So that's about 600 points and we got 100, so we need 500 more admin points. So hopefully Ottomans will attack Mamluk soon. There's also Trabizond here. They're at war with Ottomans. Okay, so they went that way. They've attacked Dolkadir, Kara, Hansa. 
Hazza Ak and Trebizond. Okay, so their next war is in uh, this area over here. Gives us a little bit more time. Oh, did we build that ship already? Let's get him to work in Constantinople. All right. That means we're making double the money now. We'll save up for one more ship then. What about uh, Venice here? Come on. We're best buddies, you know, remember? Negative 14 now. Hmm. Missionary strength 1%. Yep, yeah, I could use that uh, soon, but uh, can't really use it right now. It's just too bad. What are the Mamlocks up to? Uh, not nothing much actually. I guess they're just waiting for the day that the Ottomans push the button. Same as I do, actually. We are very close to being ready for that war. All right, pay some money, get stability and prestige. Yep, definitely. We are plus three stability. Prestige is still minus eight. And we are getting closer to, oh, look at Aragon. They've taken out Mantua. No, that is Mantua. But they've taken out Urbino and currently occupying the Papal State, but they've got Castile on their ass. That's a losing battle. So let's see how the, the Ottomans are faring here. They have a couple of cores here that they will probably go for. And then I'd really like to see them attacking the Mamluks after that. Like, really like. Making half a ducat now. Now you see it's going forward. Nice and easy. Oh, they're now at war with the Papal State, Croatia, and Genoa. And currently getting occupied by Croatia here. Come on, Venice. Stupid. Oh, they, they will ally me now. Let's see. Are they worth allying? Do they have any ships left? Doesn't seem like it. They got three transport ships and three light ships. So no, they're not really worth allying anymore. Neither is Aragon. Hmm. They're more than likely getting involved in another war up there, so. What about Corfu? So Vassal of Venice, they will probably be released soon. There's also the chance that, uh, that the Ottomans will try to go for Corfu. So the big question now. Once this war is over, will they go for me or will they go for the Mamluks? If they go for me, all of this would have been in vain. <laughs> I can get Divine Supremacy, let's go grab it right away. So now I just need to save up some admin points for, for the coring. And that's about it. We are ready for war. But if the Ottomans attack the Mamluks, we might actually pull this off. And since the time is up, that will be revealed in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. Oops. See you next time. Bye-bye.